Hey, it's Matt from Custom Car Grills with a mesh install for the 2023 and newer Honda CRV. Removal of the grill from the bumper is not needed, but to gain access to the back of the grill, you'll need to remove the bumper. Linked in the description is a video tutorial on how to handle the bumper removal to get caught up to this point where we can start in on the mesh. And our mesh piece is going to be pre-cut specifically for these 2023 and newer CRVs. They're made from our aluminum small diamond mesh and finished off with a gloss black powder coat. This mesh will help deflect most road debris from damaging your radiator and avoid costly repairs. We're going to do this install from the back of the stock grill, so let me flip this around and then it's just a matter of getting the mesh oriented in place. There's going to be a small amount of overlap all the way around, which is intentional to get you good full coverage. Next up, let's grab the supplied cable ties and take a look at how we're going to mount the mesh to the grill. The game plan is to tie the mesh directly to the thin vertical support bars. Here's a quick look at a layout of where the ties would be least noticeable when finished, and it's important to note that the one opening directly below the emblem doesn't need ties. I like to start on the bottom edge first, and tying the mesh on is quite simple. Start by feeding the tail end of the tie from behind the grill through a diamond opening near the thin bar. Then loop the tie over the bar and back through an adjacent diamond opening. Loosely fasten the tie together at first and then pull it tight with the head of the tie resting flat on the back of the mesh. Now let's move on to another opening on the bottom and repeat those steps again. We're including enough ties with this kit to fasten the mesh to the bars that was circled earlier in this video. Once finished, the mesh will be attached firmly to the grill and the ties will also be blended in quite well. Work your way up the grill with the ties until the last opening has the mesh secured on. Make sure that during this process, the mesh hasn't shifted off of the opening. Again, there should be a little bit of overlap all the way around, which gives us a little bit of clay to work with. Once the ties are all fastened on, then just come back with some wire cutters and trim off the tail ends of the ties and throw them away. The install of the mesh to the grill is done already, and that was pretty quick to do. Let's flip this around and see what it looks like from the front. Well, there you have it. it looks like the CRV radiator is going to be pretty well protected from here on out. Only the smallest of road debris is going to have a chance of passing through, and it's hard to believe how large those factory openings were beforehand. Now it's just a matter of reinstalling the bumper back onto the vehicle, and we're done. Here's a picture of how one of these looks installed. The mesh blends right in, and the ties are almost undetectable. Overall, installation on one of these makes for a nice weekend project with just some basic tools. It's well worth the time and effort so that you can get peace of mind knowing that you're going to be better protected from a costly repair than before. Well, that's all I have for this video. If you can subscribe to the channel, that would help me out quite a bit. If you have any questions, then feel free to drop them down in the comments or email me. And thanks for watching.